Hello everyone, this is Sherwin here from TechOS and today I'm going to be taking a look at Mail in OS X El Capitan. Now Apple have added some new features and some of them are similar to the iPad version so I'm just going to take a look at those in this video. So if I open Mail up here as you can see I have got a few emails open and obviously I've got this side bit blurred out, I don't want you to be able to see my accounts so I don't want to be receiving spam but anyway this is my inbox and the first feature I want to show you is gestures in mail so as you know in iOS you can swipe on a message you can swipe all the way to the left to delete and all the way to the right to mark as unread and you can do this now do the same in OS 10 so as you can see here if I've got this email here that I, I know I want to keep read later I think I need to refer this to a friend then all I can do is just slide across all the way and then let go and it will mark it as unread and down here the, the same thing works for deleting so down here employment alert I can see this um, job alert obviously I don't want to this so I can just this is sort of an ad and just swipe off and delete that and that will be that's now gone so that's a nice feature to have and the second feature is also sort of taken from the iPad feature um, so sort of the iPad version which is where if I'm composing a new email now this is in full screen mode only so if you're working and the mail isn't full screen then this won't apply um, what you can do is if I want to access something in my inbox so I'm just going to type in a email address which I want to send it to I'm just going to send this to um, put my subject as twitch event and you'll see why in a minute so now what I'm going to do is I'm just going to choose which email address I want it to be sent from here you go this one and I'm going to change this email at the top to a different email just for now obviously I've blurred it out I don't want you to be able to see that but that's my message sort of done now I just want to type in here so um, here is the sorry not that here are the details for the twitch event now I want to send this person the details so what I can do is as in the iPad version I can click off my mail or my message and as you can see like the iPad version it drops down to here to the bottom so now that's um, there I can access the rest of my inbox so here's the message I marked as unread that I wanted to get back to later and I've got this sort of image here which contains details I'm just going to drag this down to my email as you can see it pops up I can just let go and it will drag it there so if I want to send this I can have that I'll just write down here sort of sign the email off don't know why my signatures aren't working but that's something to figure out for later and there you go I've got my email I can now send it now as I'm while I'm here I'm just gonna go um, down here get off the message click on new message and as you can see it's now added two messages so I've got sort of tabs so if I wanted to send this to someone else from a different email so if I want to say to send it to this person from a different email so I can just go here I can decide to copy this, paste it, oh, paste it there. And now what I can do is I can drag this image, oh, I can drag the image over. Well, actually, it won't work for this particular sort of example. I've got a bad, I've picked a bad example here, but obviously I can go back into my inbox, drag it here. It won't work, but that's something that I can figure out how to do later I will see if I can update you on that but anyway so I've got my email so basically what this allows you to do is have two emails running in the same um, full screen mail app so I can obviously move tabs around and I can open the tab in its own window simply by doing that so yeah I'm just gonna go ahead and close this tab I'm gonna save the draft 
I'm just going to cancel that email and I'm going to save that either. So that was a look at mail. And now another feature which I can't show you due to sort of the reason, the various reasons. I haven't got an email that supports this at the moment. But if I go back and I'll go into Safari. This is Apple's website, but there you go. So mail can now add suggested events. So if mail sees something like this over here, sees obviously it has the at 2 p.m. here. Mail will automatically add a calendar event. You can just click add up here as it says over here. And the same works with contact. So these are features that we've seen in iOS 8. Obviously they've now been carried over to the Mac to make it better experience and a more um, cohesive sorry, cohesive experienced experience, sorry. So that was a look at mail in OS ten El Capitan. If you've got any questions or comments you can post them below in this video or you can get in contact with me. All the ways of contacting me will be up at the end of the video and in the description. Don't forget to like this video by giving it a thumbs up. Thank you very much for watching and I'll see you in the next video.